is Film 351, and this semester it's a client media production, so we're actually making short promotional films for clients. Basically, the way you have to think about it is that you have a boss. It's You're not your own boss, because I feel like in the other classes, when you're the director, you are your own boss, but in this one you're not, because there's a client that wants something and you need to give it to them, and they have the choice to be happy or unhappy with it. So we're making a video for ProChange, which is a research development company that does research on PTSD for our project, and it's a video that's gonna be integrated into an app. My group's client this semester was the Roger Williams Park Natural History Museum and Planetarium in Providence. So we were tasked with making just a simple video that would help promote the museum and like get them out there to say that they actually exist. Really in any other class, you don't have like the real factor, it's kind of just for the grade. It's one thing to make things for class or for just the school, but it's another thing to make them for real clients with real budgets and real deadlines. So in the client media production class, a few of the weeks, speakers would come, for example, Adventures and Animus Studios, and they would kind of tell us how the real world is and how their studio and how their company works and what they do for other clients, which is pretty much what lines up with this class and exactly what we're doing. So it was cool to see how someone from the industry came in to see what we were doing and to help us. The experience for me has definitely been an interesting one because there are a lot of obstacles that come in a way that you can't plan of and you can't predict. Everything takes longer than you think it's gonna take. If you plan a shoot for a few hours, maybe two to three hours, you're probably gonna be there for six to seven hours. Once you have it edited, they can say, okay, well, we want this to be changed, we want this to be changed, and you have to do that because that's your client. You have to try to find a way to work around the obstacles that you're brought up with. Definitely the most challenging part is just the pressure of actually making something for someone who's gonna use it for some other purpose to sell something. I would recommend client media production because you get real world experience with real world clients and you get to know what it's really like to work with people. It's definitely been a pretty valuable experience in terms of just getting a feel for what the field is actually like.